Okay guys, so I have really, really exciting news to share with everybody. It's pretty emotional. I don't know exactly how to say this, but I am moving out. A lot of you guys who follow my brother see that he purchased a new home. Congratulations, Brian. I love you and I'm so happy for you. Well, I also bought a new home. We are both moving out separately. It's really emotional because everybody who knows me knows I'm a family man. I, I love my family to death. And just waking up every morning, seeing my mom's face, my dad's face, Brian's face, it just it makes me happy. I love my family. But at the same time, you know, life is all about new beginnings. Um, life changes. You can't just be doing the same thing from the day you're born till the day you die. So me and my brother both decided that it was the right time. You know, I just turned 25. My brother's about to be 24. So 25, 24 years old. We decided that it is the right time to move out of the house, move away from our parents. Um, it's not easy, but we did both buy new homes. As emotional as I am right now, it's just cause I'm sad thinking about leaving my parents. But at the end of the day, I am so excited that I'm moving into a new home and I'm so excited for you guys to come along this journey with me. I'm not gonna reveal what the house looks like until my next video. I don't have the keys yet. So my next video will for sure be a new house reveal and bring you guys with me on this journey. Cause if it wasn't for you guys, I would never be able to buy myself a home. I love you guys so much and thank you for all the support that you show me and my family. All you people watching this video, you mean so much to me and my family. I don't think you guys understand and Today's my last day living with my family, my last day living with Brian. I don't wanna leave in an upset mood, I wanna leave happy. So I'm gonna take the rest of this day, spend it with my family, enjoy my last night in this house. And again, just because I sound sad, that doesn't mean I'm sad that I bought a house. I'm so happy and excited, I'm just, I'm just, my heart feels some type of way that I'm leaving my parents and my brother. And, you know, as, as, as a person, I'm allowed to be proud of myself. So, you know, I'm usually hard on myself, but I think now after purchasing a brand new home, I think I could give myself a little pat on the back, Brandon. Good job, Brawadis. Mom, dad. Brandon. What's up? Hi, Brandon. Hey, mom. How are you? Um, emotional, how are you? Okay. <laughs> Uh, it is okay. emotional yeah. day. You know, you moved by yourself like a, a year in the apartment. Yeah. It was, that's the first time you left us and it was like... It was hard. It was hard. It was different for us because mm -hmm. we've been living together and we got used to like... Everything's about you. About you guys you. love me. Yeah, the fun <laughs> we have. And you got back with us. It's been like, what, six months? Six yeah, months? I've been back here for at least six months. Six yeah. months. And it was like... You know, the best dream time. come true. Like, okay, Brandon's back. You know, we have a good time. Everybody here, you know, Jackie, we're Brian, complete. You, Brian, the dogs. Taylor, Jackie, <laughs> the dogs. We had fun. Full I mean, house. Now, now you say again, you, you're moving out, you bought a house. I mean, it's eventually it's gonna happen one day. But, you know, us, you know, it, it hit us over here. But, yeah. It's always hard for the parents to accept it. They know that day's coming. And they don't want it to come. Yeah, I'm but getting old, 25. Them. I know, but it's different. Like some people leave their houses when they're 18, 17, yeah. younger. Yeah, we're not like that. No, we were, we were so close. I mean, mo him moving out is not going to keep us like apart from each other. Oh, I'll be no. back here every day. Oh, yeah. well, every we'll day I'll come see you guys. It's not that feeling in the morning. Brandon, breakfast is ready. Yeah. Good night, Brandon. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. Guys, I just turned 25 who knows maybe soon i'm gonna get married start a family like I, god I'm, can you hear that <laughs> I, i'm almost 30 years old so like i said me and brian both decided it was time to just you know we move on, move on. it happens to everyone i'm glad i did it at 25 instead of 18 19 20 because i love the 25 years i lived with you guys i loved it it was fun like you said we're so close as a family so Every night was fun, every morning was fun, every day was fun. You guys gotta come over yeah, almost every day. Oh, no, you're gonna wake up in the morning, you're sitting and watching Netflix. <laughs> <I know. laughs> Make sure you have Netflix and good internet. Oh, man. And I always say, whatever makes them happy and they're safe, I'm with them 100%, their choices, they're, they're doing the right things. 
I'm sure, and I'm so proud of them. And I'm gonna save some tears because we have another video with the other one. <laughs> with Brian, Brian yeah, also, that, yeah. The problem is they decided to close of it. We're both moving out around the, around same, the time. same time. Yeah. And that's gonna be a little hard. We still have lots. Okay, well, can I have, you know, a hug? Yeah, hug, Mom, hug, hug. and kiss. Listen, stay safe. Uh, I don't know. Like, be happy. Fosley, it's my last night with you, bro. Are you gonna miss me? Is Bosley gonna miss me? Guys, I'm gonna miss Bosley so much. I love this dog so much. Guys, a lot of people don't know this. Bosley was my 18th birthday gift. That's all I wanted for my 18th birthday. And now I'm leaving him. Are you gonna miss me, Bosley? Starting to move some of my stuff out. It's a sad day moving out, but not when you got Papa Rug helping you. Always. Uh, don't, don't break that TV when the basketball comes back. Oh, when the sun TV comes back, the TV's broken. Okay guys, so we're moving some of my stuff from my room out right now. So we don't have to do it all at once tomorrow. We're just getting a little bit of a head start. This is so sad guys, look. The dresser and the TV's gone. I'm gonna miss this house, I'm not gonna lie. Okay guys, so it's finally dinner time. Let's see what Mama Rug and Papa Rug are cooking for Brawadis' last night at home. <laughs> My final dinner. Something smells so bomb. Trust me guys, I got a huge nose so I could smell things a mile away. Oh my God, something smells bomb. Oh Chef! Yeah. Woo! So good. Do you have a reservation, sir? Excuse me? Do you have a reservation? Uh, if you don't have one, you can't come in. Sorry. Yeah. Who are you talking to, Willis? Oh, we got some shrimp. You like them? They're big. Some onions, some mushrooms, and some. Teriyaki. Oh yeah. Dinner at the Awadis household. Is lit. Is what? Lit. It's litty. What? It's yummy. Oh, it's crunchy. Okay, he's getting <laughs> close to my Okay, mom, what's your biggest pet peeve about me? You getting so close to me. You record me with my Christmas pajama every day. Whenever I wear it, you say she wears every day. Hey, I'm your son and you don't want me to get close to you? What? Get close to me without the camera. Okay. Don't zoom in. Zoom out. There, I'm close to you without. Oh, <laughs> oh. Don't be shy, put some more. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you, Dad. Thank you, Mom. Of course. Thank you, Jackie. Booker, where's the bed? Everything's gone. <laughs> Little dude is confused. Where's everything at? Oh, he's confused. Look at this. This is our last night here. The last time me and my dad are taking Bosley pee together. <gasps> Bosley, did you go pee? Our last time taking him pee together. Come on, make it a, a good, memorable pee, Bosley. <laughs> dad, so I took my whole bed apart. We moved it downstairs in the truck. And I forgot I still had one more night here. So now <laughs> I have to sleep in this room. Oh my God. Dad, he's making it so memorable from my last night. He didn't pee, he, he pooped. <laughs> he pooped, Bosley. They got a prize. <laughs> now that's a way for me to go off with a bang. Wow. <laughs> and for the last time of me living here, Bosley, you want a treat? Let's go get a treat. Come on. Let's go get a treat. Oh, now you move. Okay, and stand up. <laughs> stand up, up. Good boy, here you go. This is it, bro. Again, bro? 
literally our last night living together. We've been living with each other, what, for the past six months now? And now I've been living together again for the last six months. And now we're both moving out. Dude, dude, we're literally just growing up. That's it. We're growing up and like I mentioned in my video earlier, I wish I could live with my parents and Brian till the day I die. But that's just not how life works. You have to move on, you have yeah. to, I don't know, bro, but it's actually sad, dude. At least we're like still all gonna be close. That's the good mm -hmm. thing. That's so sad, dude. Dude, it's it's crazy. Like waking up, going downstairs, not seeing my mom and dad anymore. Yeah. Look, walking across the hall and not seeing you playing video games, not seeing you pick up a camera. What is going on, guys? Faze rug here. It's gonna feel so weird not seeing that in my life. But I want, bro. I want to make a promise to you right now. Okay we're moving away like separate from each other and i'm gonna miss you like i love living with you so i'm gonna make you a promise i don't know when this is gonna be uh-huh it could be the day before i die or it could be in a couple years but i will make you a promise i'm going to live with you again before i die whether you oh. like it or not oh <laughs> for sure i'm down for that promise yeah it, it, i mean even if you said no bro i'm gonna live with you again we have to, bro. We can't just never live with each other. Even no. if we're married, we could somehow make it work. Yeah, bro, we're brothers. Even if we're married, we'll, we're, we'll force our wives to be like, you know what? I'm living with Brian. Exactly. So I'll tell my wife you could come with me if you want, or you could stay somewhere I'm else. I'm down. I'm down. Dude, I, I, don't, I don't want me sitting here right now in this empty room. I don't want this to be the last time that I live with my brother. Brian, I just want to say the last six months, I had a lot of fun. I don't regret any, any minute of it. I loved it waking up and hearing you in the background what is going on guys face yeah. rug here and i will say one thing over the last six months my channel has been doing a lot better the views have gone up and that's because ever since i moved in with you i see how hard you work and how much Thank work you, you put into your videos how much Thank effort you. you put into your youtube videos and it's contagious so i picked up a lot of that from you so thank i want to say bro. thank you i loved every second of the last six months and like I said, bro, we're gonna live with each other one more time soon, so. I love you, brother. Love you too, bro. Oh, I'll see you soon. I mean, like, Man. I'm probably gonna come to your house every day, and then you're gonna come to my new house. But, but still, it's bro. It's still the living it's, part. It's, it's different. different. It's, it's really different, different bro. Man. But. <sighs> Man. It's okay. Guys, we gotta, we gotta cut the camera now. <sighs> peace, peace. peace. Hold, bro, bro, before you go, I know this is supposed to be like a sad, like, emotional, like, moment. I'm gonna confront you about something. So when I moved in here, the first week I moved in here, you pulled a prank on me. Hey, what did you do? I made your room beautiful. You made my room yellow and purple for the Lakers. You got LeBron James, Pal Gasol, LeBron James. And you promised me one thing after the prank. You said, dude, dude. After the prank, which was six months ago, <laughs> Brian goes, dude, dude, my bad, my bad. I promise I'm gonna, I'm gonna make your room Phoenix Suns colors. I'm gonna change it in like tomorrow, tomorrow. This was six months ago. Here I am, I lived here for half a year and I'm about to move out. I just bought a home and look at my room. It's still Laker colors. Dude, you listen. failed me. You dude, let me just live with it. Like get out, get out, get out, bro, get out. Bosley, I'm gonna miss living with you so much. I love you. I love you. You going to sleep? Yes, sir. Can I get like a good night hug, bro? Last, Last night. Oh, man, bro. We'll be good, bro. We'll be good. Wait, 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 wait. Before you go to sleep, don't forget. I made a promise. Come oh, here. Dude, come dude I Why made a promise. Me and you are going to be living with each other one day. I don't care we'll if it's when I'm 80, when I'm 30, when I'm. 25 it could be this year i don't care this might be the last night for me in this house but this is not the last night for me and you living together the look at this gonna be crazy trust me Dude, trust me bro this is proof guys you saw it trust me all right good night brian i love you and i'm proud of you for getting your own house and i can't wait for the fans to see it his house reveal is going to come a little later than mine he's still getting some stuff worked out but brian did get a new house brian i'm proud of you congrats you're 23 years old bought a new house Good night, bro. I love you. I love you too. Booker, I'm gonna miss you so much. Booker, give him a kiss. Give him a kiss. Oh. Love you too. The last six months were fun. Thank you for everything, for taking me in. Thank you. I know. Good luck and 
we're gonna we're gonna be close. We're gonna be seeing each other. We're gonna be. I'll be back. I swear, you might not believe me. I'll probably be back to the point where you're gonna be sick of me and say, "Didn't you move out? Why are you still here?" You better do that. I am. I swear, I am. So, don't worry. Good luck. Thank you. Stay safe. One, one more <laughs> hug. One more hug. <laughs> Okay guys, so if you've made it this far into the video, if you've been watching this deep into the video, I think you deserve to be rewarded. So I know I said my whole next video is going to be the new house tour, but I'm not gonna lie, when I went to look at the house before I bought it, I did record a small little clip, a small little clip. So I'm gonna put that clip in this video right now. A little sneak peek of the house. It's not gonna show too, too much. So before we get into the sneak peek, I just wanna say, guys, I love you so much. I'm excited to bring you guys along with me on this journey. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Mom, dad, when you're watching this part, I don't want you guys to be sad. I will be back here almost every single day. Your mom, dad, I love you guys. Brian, I love you. Bosley, I'm gonna miss. I love Bosley so much. And here's the sneak peek of the house. Psh. can never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right